Hello friends, I'm Oom and today we're diving in the fantastic world of FidoS. And we're gonna see the latest or the greatest update of FidoS till today, version 20. And this update comes with a lot of amazing, the best updates of FidoS. And I have decided that I'm going to install FidoS and replace Windows. Yes, and a video about Arch Linux plus FidoS dual boot system is coming on the channel later. So don't forget to subscribe if you don't want to miss that one. And let's dive deep into the update, shall we? So first, let me just show you. Let me just hide it. So first thing first, this is the new wallpaper of FidoS 20. And the main highlight of the video is the new notes application. Now, I must tell you, it is not just a notes application. It is the best note application ever. Forget Notion, forget Obsidian, forget Beaver Notes, forget MarkText. This is the real deal. You see, let me just show you. Let's say I've created this document and when you see it here and if you have ever used Notion then you might figure out one thing that it is literally just the same like Notion but better. You see just like Notion it uses FidoS AI with their FidoS Notes application and you can literally create anything you want. Literally anything. For example I want to make table and then I just want it to be like this. All the features of Notion are available here and if you want to import notion templates then it is also possible here and you can import markdown files which are from beaver notes and mark text and just normal simple text or just snapshots everything is here and if you go there you have all documents you have journals which you can create device and i literally like this and then when you go to system you have option to customize every part of the whole application using the theme editor literally every part of this notes application you can edit each and everything. Just beautiful. Let me just enable URL preview because I like that. Now going back to the documents. As you can see you have full fledged notes application. Not a notes application. A proper notion with database like things. Like you have the calendar here. You can set a template for a journal. Let's try it. Well I will need to import the templates right now. But they will. Okay I can actually create a new template just by that. Nice. And all the things are automatically saved here. And as you can see, it is looking damn good. You have all the options of Notion along with Notion's calendar application, table of contacts, all frames, almost everything. Well, we'll cover this particular application in detail. And yes, I'm going to switch to FireOS just for this notes application. I love it. Finally, you have power modes on FireOS, which allows you to save a chunk of cpu and ram usage while consuming less power and then there's a welcome recap yep if you just somehow closed all your applications and then turned off your pc and reboot it then you will have the option to resume where you left amazing and then you have a snap group option which illustrates the improved window management for multitasking damn great and then you have option to actually install microsoft 365 Literally man, this is just amazing. And it can be easily synced as well, which highlights the seamless integration of Microsoft 365 services. And then we have a lot of under the hood updates as well. Now it uses Vulkan GPU throughout the whole operating systems, even on low end systems with lower hardwares and older CPUs. And then most of the Wi-Fi problems which everyone was getting are now removed. Damn great. You see, that was the main problem for a lot of users that their Wi-Fi or Bluetooth was not working. But now it is. And let me just show you something. You can actually directly install Steam from here. When you type Steam, there it is. You have Steam installer. Then you have Android installer as well in which you can play Free Fire with keyboard and mouse support and all the games using keyboard. Yes. So all the people who want to install an Android based operating system along with amazing applications like this notes application and then how can you forget the FidoS AI seamlessly integrated into the system there and along with that the power of Linux you know you have terminal just like that so if someone asks me that they don't have to you know do some proper video editing stuff or coding and just want a simple operating system for day-to-day -day task and some internet browsing media consumption gaming then FidoS is the best operating system and I'm going to install it right away as dual boot. 
And I believe that's it for today's video because this video was about what is new in the update. A proper review where I explore each and every application is gonna be coming to the channel. So don't forget to subscribe for more awesome tech videos and I'll meet you in the next video. Till then, I'm Um, signing out.